dusty. The shoemaker worked hard, but no matter how many shoes he made, he couldn't earn enough money to live upon. Oh. Finally, the day came when all that he had left in his workshop was one small piece of leather. Oh. What's leather? Oh. Stuff you make shoes from, Jake. Yeah. <laughs> That evening, the shoemaker carefully cut out the leather to make his last pair of shoes the following morning. The next day, the shoemaker went downstairs. And there, on his work table, stood a fine pair of shoes. Oh, someone's been helping him. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's the elves. They were the most exquisite pair of shoes he had ever seen. Oh, I'm sure somebody will want to buy those lovely shoes. Oh, I think you might be right, Fizz. Yeah. That morning, a very rich man came into the workshop and tried on the shoes. Well, they suited him so well that he willingly offered the shoemaker a lot of money. So the shoemaker was able to buy enough leather to make two more pairs of shoes. Oh. Yes, and his special helpers will be back. You wait and see. Oh, you know? Were there some more shoes there the next day, Judy? Uh, were there? Let's see. <laughs> In the morning, he found both pairs of shoes sitting on his work table with not a stitch out of place. Oh, Told you! Yeah. Soon, the two customers arrived, and they paid him handsomely, for they had never seen such fine shoes. Oh. Now he could buy enough leather for four new pairs of shoes. Wow. The same thing happened as had happened before. During the night, the leather was made into four perfect pairs of shoes. <laughs> then, one evening... The shoemaker said to his wife, I would like to sit up and watch tonight so that we may see who it is that comes and does my work for me. Yeah. So they left a candle burning, hid themselves behind a curtain in a corner of the room <laughs> and waited. <laughs> as soon as the town clock struck midnight, in came two little elves, oh. quite naked. <laughs> <laughs> they haven't got any clothes on. <laughs> up all the leather that was cut out and set to work. They stitched and wrapped and hammered and tapped. Within a few minutes the job was done and a neat row of shoes stood ready upon the table. Oh, cool! Then the two elves scurried away. <laughs> the next evening the shoemaker's wife said to her husband, I shall make each of them a linen shirt, a silk waistcoat, and a velvet coat and pair of trousers into the bargain. Oh. You can make each of them a little pair of shoes. Oh, that's yeah. nice. That night, as the town clock struck midnight, in danced the two elves. When they saw the new clothes laid out for them, they laughed out loud. <laughs> <laughs> the shoemaker and his wife smiled at each other. Mm. The elves dressed themselves in the twinkling of an eye, yeah. and then... Just as suddenly as before, they were gone. <gasps> oh, that was a lovely story, Judy. Yeah, yeah. and elves like helping people. I know. <laughs> yes, and it looks as though some little elves have been helping me. <laughs> the playroom's so clean and tidy. <laughs> oh, and the garden. Oh, I'd better have a look. <laughs> I saw him, Milo. Huh? Saw who, mate? The elf. You saw an elf? Wow! Well, Jake pretended he saw an elf. No, I really saw him. He's my friend. Well, those elves have worked really hard <laughs> and deserve a great big thank you, <laughs> whoever they are. <laughs> have all the jobs on your um, list been done then, Judy? Oh, well, let me see. <laughs> right, clean the bathroom. Yes, I did that. Tidy the books. Oh, yes, I did that. Oh, 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 I mean, the elves did it. Dust the playroom. Yes, that was done very well, wasn't it? Uh. Yes, fold up the dressing up clothes. Oh, 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 oh. Yes. <laughs> Tidy the sandpit. Oh, yeah, we did that. And wipe down the climbing frame. Yeah. Yes, that leaves just one more job. What's oh. that? To make myself a cup of tea. Oh. <laughs> up you get, Jake. <laughs> Come on, Judy. Time for you to relax. <laughs> yes, with a nice cup of tea. Oh, thank you very much. I haven't worked that hard. I've had so much help. <laughs> Come to think of it, what have you lot been doing today? Just playing. Yeah. Just sitting about, really. <laughs> I met an elf. 
Oh, did you really? Yeah, Judy. And he said he fixed your kettle. Oh, I thought it was probably him. They're so good at fixing things. Listen, are you pleased with your elves, Judy? Yes, Fizz. I'm very pleased with all of them. <laughs> oh, it is lovely to have a bit of help sometimes. Yeah! Yay! We're elves! <laughs> we all like helping Judy. Bye-bye, Elf. <laughs> See yous. <laughs>